right, everybody, day number eight, and welcome to Hilo, Hawaii. Aloha, huh? Aloha. Welcome to Hilo. Hilo. All right, so today the game plan is we're renting a car again um, and heading over to Volcano National Park. That's the game plan, and then the Black Sand Beach is over there too. And then we'll just kind of see where the day leads us after that. Yes, let's go. Aloha. Aloha. Anyway, guys, when the um, the thing that's different about most of these Hawaiian ports is they put you off like ri right in regular container ship ports. So that's a little bit different. There's a lot of shipping here, so we're, yeah. we're, they ship a lot of stuff. Yeah, they don't really have built up cruise ports per se. So, all right, let's check it out. Well, we're jeeping it again. Here we go, we got a two door this time with a drop top. Do it. <laughs> so go ahead, babe. We're at Ken's House of Pancakes. They got so much on this menu. The menu is huge, but it's reasonable. I like the brother. <laughs> tons and tons of food. There's a lot of authentic food here, too. Yes. Like right the near the port. The coconut pancakes, the macadamia nut pancakes. They have mushrooms. Mm -hmm. And it's it's pretty reasonable. A shrimp omelet. <laughs> that sounds good. Welcome to Volcano National Park. Mahalo. How much was it? $25. Oh, but I think it's worth it. You can see the, looks like you can see the steam already. Mm -hmm. I thought that was a bit pricey for parking, but We'll see. It probably is, uh, you know, probably goes for ups and stuff. Where should the oldest one be? Remember, they're moving this way all the way up here to the northwest. These little hollow volcanoes. Here's a satellite photo of the coastline. Oh, okay. By the way, it doesn't look very big, but it's over a mile high. 5,400 feet high above sea level. <laughs> it stands up, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. So the camera lens might be steaming. This is a steam vent. It's hot. It's hot. It's hot. It's big time hot. It's hot? Very hot. I stuck my head over there and got a nice little black. Got a tree. Let's go peek at some of this one. Volcano pan. <laughs> wow, guys, a real volcano. Look at that. Thank you. 
Here's some more of the uh, steam vents. Look at this. I can't describe to you all how hot it is. The steam coming out of these, it's, it's, it's immense. Very hot. But if you look all around, over there, over there, all along there, over here is steam coming out everywhere. What you think? On top of the volcano. And the steam vents are hotter than the stove. It's hotter than it fire. So hot. It's like putting your hand over a fire. Yeah. It's really hot. Let's go get a closer look. Let's go. All right, guys. So they got a lot of the... There's a road that circles the crater, but a lot of it's closed due to dangerous air conditions, from what I understand. It's a lot of sulfur coming out of here, which is dangerous for our breathing, obviously. So this is the furthest point you can get to. <laughs> yeah, I was wondering about that. And Thank you. You ready? Let's do this. Here we go. Do I have a flashlight on my phone too? Uh huh. Now I was supposed to wear my walking shoes. Oh this. Oh, okay. So we said we get a little bit of all of it. So you guys tried the poi and stuff? Nope. <laughs> yeah, the poi is good and how key it is yummy too. It's like a jello consistency. Yeah. Okay. Ooh, that sounds good. Coconut. So, so what's like coconut. your name on YouTube? Uh, I don't have a YouTube. I just watch okay. you. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, we're following one of our persons who hunted us down <laughs> in Hawaii. And we were looking at the volcanoes and she stopped us. She said, oh, well, I know you guys. Yeah. And we are so happy to see her. We appreciate her and everything. Yeah. So we're gonna keep on walking here. We just left the lava. <laughs> we just left the lava tools. It was great. And now we're winded. <laughs> oh, man. Thank you so much. Say hi to everybody. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> To the Black Sand Beach, everybody. Yes, we did. It's very flat. <laughs> it's lava rocks, and it's the remnants of the volcano, and it's actually real sand. Yeah, let me show you the sand. I'm stepping on these lava rocks here. Look at the sand. Is 
that's sweet or what? Wow. Okay. Okay. Very windy. And come see my friend to shop for jewelry. It's all handmade and the prices are incredible. Thank you. Yeah. Well, on our way back from the Black Sand Beach and we are riding in a cloud. This is not rain. It's cloud. The cloud has set over the mountain. And we're driving in the cloud. That's something we don't do every day. <laughs> Another light driving in the rain with the top. <laughs> Man. We don't know how to work the top of the Jeep. <laughs> we get rain on right now. Hey guys, so it's the end of our vlog day. I'm not sure which day it is, but. Don't ask me. I don't know what day it is. Anyway. I think it's day seven or eight. But yeah. anyway, our captain decided to send us complimentary goodies tonight. And here they are. Compliments of Captain Joe. <laughs> I think I'm that's not how you say his name. And he sent us a really nice card with our room on it. And we have treats. So this is the end of our vlog day. We hope you enjoyed it. If you haven't watched the rest of our vlogs, go back a couple videos and watch them. We're in Hawaii the entire week. Yeah, we're supposed to be going past the volcano tonight. But we're not going past there for another two hours and I don't know if we're going to make it or not. So. Life short, have fun. Take care. Bye guys. If I may draw your attention to the starboard or right hand side of the vessel, for a brief narrative of what you are about to see. Now ladies and gentlemen, to maximize our viewing of tonight's lava flow, we will be turning off all of the lights yes. on all our decks. Woo. With that being said, please mind your footing, and if you're going in between floors, please hold on to those handrails. Also, if you're trying to get a good photo of the lava flow, the best way to do that is to turn off your flash. Again, your flash is meant to capture objects about 8 to 12 feet ahead of you. If you're slightly further out to see than that, it will not help.